Disculpe. Disculpe. Una, una pregunta. No, no, even that thing is. Yeah, I know. Yeah, so, uh, you yeah, know. Uh, See ya. So, you know what? Um, it's good, though. There is a feature where it doesn't move. Yes, it, 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 it locks. Yeah. Um, but it's weird because when you go like this, it doesn't, it doesn't, yeah, it exactly. doesn't move that much. Uh -huh. So, um, but. Yeah, once again, like I was saying earlier. So we here, Carrera 43A, El, El Poblado Avenue. So um, yeah, if you guys recognize this area, uh, you know, just say something in the comment section and make a comment. Uh, we here. This look like a that's like an office building right there. I see a lot of people coming from there from work, administration area, whatever. Where a lot of businesses um they do have in this area yeah the so people see. get off i think at 12 mm -hmm. and, and uh, they come back at 2. yeah so you see a lot of traffic between 12 to mm -hmm. 2. yeah because of people get the break lunch break at that yeah. time yeah here is different yeah that's what i realized one time uh i, I remember i had an experience like in Cartagena, right so um the I went to the bank. It was like 12 o'clock. And it was closed. It was closed. Like everybody goes out yeah. for, for lunch. But here that's different. Everybody like goes to lunch all hours. at once and they two give them two hours. hours. Yeah, like everybody go to lunch at once and they give them two hours. Yeah. So that makes it even worse. Yeah. At least you could be like, okay, everybody go, uh, go to lunch. At some, the same of, time. some of them yeah. stay, some of them stay, yeah. right? Yeah. But they don't have to. Like, yeah, you know, exactly. The whole business. Okay, the name is right there. Hotel Dan Carlton. So a lot of people stay here. It's a very popular hotel in this area, so uh, a lot of tourists, people always come stay here. Public transportation here, the bus, this bus going to Sabaneta, right here, a lot of people. And right now there's a traffic going on, and it's kind of early, but I guess people coming from work or lunch break, so people are going out to, and about to eat, whatever, to go have lunch. It's pretty much people going to start com coming back to work because it's almost 2, it's 1.40. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. It's, it's one forty. People are going back to work too. Yeah. This is a Clinica Medellin. So that's the clinic. And make sure you give the video a like, subscribe to the channel. Yeah. Fit travel is here. <laughs> Medellin, Colombia. <laughs> In the streets. Yeah. <laughs> To travel make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel so stay tuned we're going to a uh, to a barrio right yeah to a barrio so stay tuned uh we're not going alone we're gonna have you know some a uh, local guy with us who know the area he's gonna take us around uh yeah. me, me, me and uh rodrigo tv check out this channel too make sure you subscribe to rodrigo Ciao, tv everyone. so yeah man stay tuned we're going to to a place that I've never been. Uh, we're going first to a barrio and then we're going to a place that I, I don't want to tell you, so to, you, you have to uh, keep watching his videos. Yep, keep watching guys, so you can uh, get up to date. Make sure you hit that notification bell uh, when you subscribe to the channel. So that way, man, when, when, uh, when we have uh, a video dropping, so you won't miss a beat, you know? Yeah, uh, you get the notification. Yeah. You won't miss a beat. A lot of guys on motorcycle. <laughs> Shout out to Razor Rays, man. Razor Rays. The guys <laughs> on the motorcycles, man. You see them? <laughs> Razor Rays. Yeah, salute. And with Wajigo TV, give a shout out to you too, Razor Rays. Yeah, man. Yeah. We're here in the streets of Medellin, Colombia. Yeah. Uh, the weather is beautiful right now, right? Be careful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Be careful, guys. Be careful in the streets of Medellin, Colombia. Raise the rays, and I'm out. <laughs> Shout out to my boy, Raise the rays. We got. How do you feel? How do you like it? Like how? How you see the city? With... Oh man, the city of Medellin is like it's something, something magical, you know. 
something like something you special live, you don't live this yeah place, yeah i don't want to leave this place no wonder a lot of people when they come here they don't want to leave yeah, man. you know the weather man is, weather is great is perfect. we're walking and we're not we're barely sweating right now uh we should sometimes we sweat a lot but um if you it all depends on how how, how hot it is and how long you've been walking but at the same time right now we're not we're not sweating like that i sweat a little bit but you know, but it's not as bad, you know. The weather right now is about how many degrees? Probably 80 degrees right now. 81. 81 degrees. Yeah. And we're walking. It's around 145 in the afternoon. Yeah, 145 in the afternoon. Later on, it still drops. The uh, temperature drops to like, mm -hmm. last night it was like 67. But it was still all right, right? I didn't, yeah. Um, I didn't need to uh, where you know, weather. Yeah, so the, the the weather drops at night over here. <laughs> drops at night. Um, always, pretty much the weather always cloudy, or you know mostly cloudy, partly cloudy. Yeah. You know, most of the time. Right now it's nice. It's, it's kind of sunny. Yeah, it's, it's partly cloudy. There's clouds and there's a little bit of sun. Uh, the motor guys are here. So you guys watch out. <laughs> Just joking. Just joking. Give it a like to the video, guys. And, uh, you know, we make these videos to uh, people can see how things are appearing. Wherever we're going, it's like um, we, we want to inspire people to travel, right? Yeah, yeah. That's what we're doing. Uh, not only uh, check out the nightlife or stuff like that. Like, you got to do things during the day yeah, yeah. if i have information about the weather about like you know the streets about the people yeah a lot of information man you know and so like uh as you can see we're walking here and uh, i feel i don't feel unsafe i feel, I feel pretty safe yeah Some people work uh, from work yeah so uh yeah we, we feel pretty safe you know we, we know that it can be like whatever people think, but uh, like us, like we feel pretty safe. So well, you never know. You have to, have you have to be alert, you know, yeah. and things like that. See, that's why. That's why they ask. They mm -hmm. ask you because you want to give. Yeah. They keep. They look at you right away. Yeah. They don't look at me. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I owe you a lot of change. Disculpe. Disculpe. Oh. Una, una pregunta. Um, ¿De dónde vienes? ¿De dónde vienes? Ignacio? Sí. Oh my god, te ves genial. <laughs> ¿Cuál es su nombre? Daniela. Daniela, soy Fred. Mucho gusto. Mucho gusto. Soy, yo tengo un canal de YouTube y ahora estoy grabando algo para mi canal. Y, Estoy aquí, es mi, mi, mi primera vez aquí y, y es, mi, es mi amigo Rodrigo y sí. a él le gusta mucho el ejercicio. Sí. Pero estoy aquí por, por tres semanas, no, no, no haciendo ejercicio nada, porque estoy disfrutando la ciudad de, de medicina. Sí, las paisas son muy buenas. Muy lindas. Sí, muy lindas. Sí, la cosa. ¿Cuántos años tiene aquí? 27. 27. Yo tengo 43 años. Sí, tal. Por ahí que tengo ocho años. ¿Juega fútbol? Oye, ¿y dónde juegas? Ah, sí, fútbol rápido. Eh, ocho. Fútbol ocho. Ocho y ocho. Sí. Ok, she plays, she plays. Y solo mujeres contra mujeres. Estaba viendo una página de que de unas muchachas que juegan como fútbol rápido. Uh, pero no recuerdo cómo se llaman. ¿Cómo se llama talento femenino? ¿Cómo se llama? Talento femenino. Talento femenino. Y es en Laureles, las canchas. She plays football, guys. She plays soccer, like Americans say soccer, but 
and I and, and I have to let it go. Um, um, gracias por tu tiempo y la presencia. Tú vas como a almorzar o. Ah, she is picking up her lunch to go eat. Cinco. Uh, she said she trains five, five days, days a week. Five days a week. Yes, uh, for training. Uh, uh, es como profesional o solo profesional? Sí. Oh, so she play professional. Oh, professional soccer. Oh, that is her normal too. Tal vez te escribimos para ver si se puede ir a ver un partido. ¿Cuándo juegan? Hoy. ¿En serio? ¿Podemos llegar? ¿A qué horas? Sí. So we just made this guy. My boy here. Talk to her. Got her number. We talk to her. Todavía no han dicho. Entonces le, le, que le escriba y bueno. Mucho gusto, oiga, y muchas gracias por su tiempo. Que esté bien. Chao. You see how we stopped her on the street and uh, you know, just started a conversation. She didn't have any problem, you know, talking to us. Oh, this is Colombia, man. You know, you guys don't have to be afraid to oppose. The look doesn't matter, you know. I'm from man, live in the street. Eh, eh, eso es arte beautiful. Eh, eh, puedo pedirte un poco de ayuda para algo de comer. I'm hungry. Hey, esto haciendo un un on the street un video un, 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 eh, eh, para ti no, sorry, eh, que quede en el video para la próxima para quede la próxima. en el video uh -huh. está bien está bien es Medellín Colombia Colombia Welcome to the main toma toma para Marce no lo borres yeah, right. no 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 yo llevo 25 países en Colombia ah sí te gracias tengo videos tendencia soy tendencia en la en las redes Ah, sí? Sí. Ah, los últimos dos videos que hice con unos dos videos de comedia. Y la yo no de comedia. ¿Y dónde están los videos? ¿Dónde están los videos? Eh, parte de... ¿Están en YouTube? Eh, como... Yeah, we met this guy. <laughs> he started a conversation out of nowhere, and um, in the streets of uh, Medellin, this is uh, La Provenza area, um, El Poblado. Me and Rodrigo TV, we having fun in Medellin, Colombia. It's been a great adventure. Um, my videos, my videos are coming out, guys. Stay tuned. I'm gonna keep pushing these videos, and um, and um, you know, I can feel it right right now. I'm really having fun, you know, a lot of fun. I'm enjoying the whole the whole city of Medellin, and um. Yeah, it's really nice, you know. It, um, you know, I'm looking forward, man, to explore more in this city. <laughs> we got the same thing from this from this guy. <laughs> uh, yeah, I want to give that lady some change, bro. I give her some one thousand. Ah. Um, yeah, so, Beijing, Colombia, like spice eyes, like spice eyes, crossing the streets. I was thinking if we walk here and, uh, um, Avenida El Poblado, so you can, uh, have a, you haven't walked this way. Mm -hmm. Okay, that'd be good. Then we get to Santa Fe Mall, then that guy can pick us up over there. Okay, all right, so we can do that, let's go. Street 10, all right? Um, yeah. And the streets. 
Bên đây xin cửa bóng nha Scotia Bank <laughs> We got a few banks out here Here on the streets um, This area is like a Yeah. yeah, this is a commercial area, you know. You get all the those couple buildings, office buildings, you know, a lot of so all type of businesses, corporations. You know, they all here in this area. And um, yeah. And um, K-tronics. Yeah, some of I know some of you guys know. Because some of you guys know this area, so. You know, just uh, leave a comment. You see that, guys? Like poor people, man. You know. Now, these these people, um, I see a lot of them on the streets, right? So, what? what, what they from other, yeah, other, other parts of town? From, yeah, outside. Outside of Medellin. Outside of, yeah, I don't know exactly where they're from, man. But they don't need. Some of them they don't even speak Spanish. They speak uh, those dialects. Oh, okay. They speak um yeah different language. They don't speak Spanish. I'm like wow. Yeah, so and and, and they from Colombia. They're from Colombia. There's a lot of them. I don't know. They speak different I don't know language. Maybe they're homeless. Yeah. Or they have a place where uh, to stay. Mm -hmm. But uh, pretty much you see them. Uh, a lot of them you see them on the street. Yeah. On the whole day sometimes. Yeah. yeah. Like uh, over there in uh, by. Uh, Provenza, you see them yeah. pretty much all night. Yeah, they, they spread out. Like, them Provenza, you see them, <laughs> uh, you know what I'm saying, every mile, all of them spread out. So, um, yeah, guys, so we, we have to be, we got to be grateful sometimes, man, you know, uh, for what we have, you know. Um, it's unfortunate, you know, we can't, we can't fix the world. We can't help out. We can't help everybody. Yeah, everybody. But you know, it's sad to see, you know. And um, even my, you know, this the country that I was born at, I say that a lot of my video, Haiti is going through a lot right now too. A lot of people are suffering. People are leaving Haiti to go all over. All over, yeah. yeah leaving Haiti to go to Mexico. Um, they're going to like small island countries, Dominican Republic. Can't even, don't even have, <laughs> you know, much, but. <laughs> We still go there to try to survive, you know. So, um, yeah, it's life. From the people from uh, Haiti to go to uh, Republic Dominican Republic, you just have to. You need a uh, document. Uh, uh, we need a visa. We need a, vi a visa. Yeah, I think so. You pay. You, you you just pay for it. Yeah. Anybody, uh, if you know the information is the right way, just let me know. Help me out. But as far as I know. We do need the uh, we do need visa to go there, but that's not the case really. You know, yeah, it's like, cross, like you kind of cross in a way, like yeah. okay, like you know, yeah. not in the right way, but oh shit. <laughs> but uh, when you cross, <laughs> yeah, we're doing. We try to help them out too, guys. Yeah. Whenever you see these people, man, just give them some a little bit of change if you if you have some. Um, you know, we, we try to help as much as we can. You know, you know. So over there you have a nice uh, shopping center, Oviedo. Yeah. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, I see the name. Yeah. You know, like whatever. <laughs> Uh, restaurant. This, this restaurant here? Yeah, it's pretty famous. So, so people come, a lot of videos on YouTube. People come in at this place. Oh, okay. Uh, it's really good. I've been here and I've been the one in Bogota too. Okay. The one in Bogota, DC, the one in Bogota, mm -hmm. and Chia. Chia. Okay. A steakhouse and uh, the name is Andres Carne de Reyes. This one it only says Andres Medellin. Yeah, yeah. It's probably some of you guys probably know about this place. So uh, yeah, it's very famous. A lot of people know about it. Oh.